What up, fish people? Kenny E with Danikin Aquatics. Hey guys, I'm coming to you from my kitchen. <laughs> anyway, we set up a 72 gallon bow front Tankanikan African cichlid tank. And it turned out rather well. We already had the Reginis in here. And we picked up some smaller Leilupis. And then we went with these guys, which these guys are right here. They are Cipricolotus boa cancanese, I guess. I'm probably butchering it. Anyway, and then we also picked up those guys. And those guys are the trets right here. Negochromus tret. Anyway, these little guys, when they get big, are going to be gorgeous. They get like this uh, light chrome blue with black fins. They're... It's going to take them a while to get there, but we got nothing but time. Anyway, then these little guys will get a little bigger, but still going to probably put some compressor steps in here. Um, a couple other little tank and eek and cichlids. Debating if I want to go with the Khaleesi's again. They're real hard to keep and super sensitive to water changes. So still debating. My wife's even considering putting some Shelly's in here as well, a different type than what we already have. But uh, we basically, we had a bunch of this lace rock. So we used lace rock and then as well as planting a few plants. My wife likes her crypts and her valves and area. So anyway, that's what she put in here. We also made additions to our 135 downstairs. She did get some uh, millennial rain or millennium rainbows, both albino and regular. Uh, let's see what else did we pick. Picked up another really cool dragon blood. So yeah, things are going good. And then we also picked up a couple of. Uh, we already had two, but we went and picked up two more juvenile uh, tilapia. So uh, anyway, have to excuse me this morning, guys. I'm a little out of it, a little tired. It's been a busy week. Did finally find an employment. I'm going to be a consultant for Auto Solutions which basically I will, will be helping credit union members buy cars. I will be Monday through Friday, 8.30 to 4.30, so that's going to be awesome for my fish. I'm going to have a lot more time to spend on the fish stuff. Anyway, if you're in the Portland area, I can sell you any type of new car you're looking for as well as any used car. So I have no, by being a consultant, I can get you whatever you need. Anyway, hope you guys are having a great start of your week. Today's Monday. I am got a few things I got to get accomplished here. I start my new position on the first, so got a bunch of water changes and whatnot to get done. I will promise to shoot you some videos of the new rainbows downstairs. I do have some more discus coverage. I basically uh, went in this morning. We lost our first batch of eggs, and I see that our Blue Diamonds have decided to lay another bunch on a cone this time. Still have three Corys in there. I'm still trying to catch. They're tricky little boogers to get. They're extremely fast, but my, that's my goal by the end of the day here is get all the Corys out and every snail that I can find out. So I'm hoping if all goes well in a couple of days here, I'll have some discus wigglers and from there hoping to get some fry to raise up. I plan to keep the parents in as long as possible because I know that they do feed them. We're getting kind of excited about that as well. But I want to do at least give you guys some footage on this. I meant to do it yesterday, but we have our daughter from Seattle down, so we've been doing some family stuff. So yeah, guys, this is our new 72. This is, a, again, a temporary spot for it for now. 
until we get everything downstairs all set. Anyway, guys, as always, love your fish. This is Kenny E. with Danikin Aquatics. Check it out for now. Y'all have a great Monday.